I'm going to talk about magic voicings, which I call magic voicings because the same shape kind of magically transforms itself into several different chords. I could put an F under it, and it's an F13 chord. It contains the notes, the flat 7, the 9, the 3rd, and the 6th are 13th, un an unaltered dominant 13th. I can put an E flat under it. Now it's an E flat major 7, sharp 11. Root, 3rd, sharp 4, or sharp 11, and major 7. These voicings are really versatile because we take care of, of an unaltered dominant sound, an altered dominant sound, a major 7 sound, a minor 7 sound, and a half diminished sound. Half diminished, voicing 2, voicing 2, now on this minor chord, I want a minor seven because it's a two function. It's going to resolve to a five chord. In improvisation, basically at any time we have some kind of harmony or chord sound and to which we can relate one or more different kinds of scales. For a major chord, that's basically going to be a Lydian, that's sharp 11. I may use voicing one instead of voicing two or vice versa to get either an unaltered or an altered sound depending on kind of what the improvisation is doing. <laughs>